All right, guys, I'm gonna show you my morning chores, what I do every morning. And so far, I already, I just let these guys out and I already fed them a lot. Gave them all their feed and they're just all happy. The sun's just about to come out too. This is gonna be a really nice day today. I'm not too sure what I'm gonna do today, but I'm, I have to do something. Cause uh, I think tomorrow and uh, Thursday it's gonna rain all day. <laughs> it looks the peacock beat the uh, game bird. Whoa. It's probably higher in the pecking order. Look at my beautiful black Muscovy. You can see the little green sheen it got on it uh, once it when it, once it gets in the sun. And I think this this hen might go breed right here. This game bird hen, why hackle? Cause I've been letting them make their clutch, and they have a lot of eggs so far. I'll show you. I mean, look at their eggs. That's their uh, how many is it? It's not. It's eleven eggs, I think. Yeah, eleven eggs. Wait, yeah, eleven eggs. So it's any day now before she goes broody. Last night she actually slept on them and like was making the broody noises. But uh, I think she's just practicing for the real thing. Once she gets like the real thing, she'll actually start to sit on them day and night. After that, if she goes broody, I'm gonna give her some silky eggs, silver sea brights and some modeled English Orpingtons. And I might let her, let her hatch two of her own, just to see how fun they're gonna come out, mixed with my toe bump Polish frizzle rooster and a game hen, which is, that's gonna be really in interesting. And uh, well, today's gonna be my morning chores and I'm just uh, walking around what I do every day. So, like I said, so far all I did was uh, let her out, give them food. They already have the water, three gallon right there, a bucket in there. They have their water already, so all I really have to do is let them out and feed them. I mean, I could use the trough, but uh, I'm, I might start using it later once I feed them a lot. So I'll be back, you guys, when I uh, go down there and feed them, feed those guys too. All right, you guys, let's continue. You see, the ducks are already swimming in the pool. These guys right here, they're always fed and watered. But right now I see they knock down their food, I mean their water. Something has to uh, refill it. Look at this color coming out. He has like some orange on his neck now. That long cape they have, that's coming out on him. It was my quail, my bob white quail. I mean, I've been looking for him, you guys, but I just can't find any bob, like, any female quail. Any like, like bob white quail in general, I can't find any. You guys can see I put the fence right here, cause uh, we already uh, we already put our uh, our corn uh, seeds in there, so hopefully they come out really nice. And you guys can see I just blocked it all off over here from my chickens and from anything. So I do let them free range sometimes. Well, most of the times, but uh, my dad didn't really want me to because they were just messing up all his plants. And because uh, chickens scratch, I mean I could let a duck in here, but that's about it. But uh, once the uh, just to see them all in here. My two silkies laid an egg yesterday. Oh, it's an egg. Oh, no. Stop. I told you, see? I have a fake egg in there, and they just like roll back here for some reason. So let's get, uh, let's get, let's get started to feed them, dude. So I got this right now. Just mixing up the, uh, I don't have that. I don't have that two by four here dividing uh, the food. I mean, like the thing anymore. Oh, look, he's pecking the camera. He's really pecking the camera. Look at him. Show me something. Like, I mean, you guys can just see he's really super nice. Like, in color wise, 
I don't know what's happening here. What happened here? Like I never teased him. Never did anything. But yeah, he's trying to kill the camera. What are you doing, Fed? Look at him. He, he kicks his, his ladies in the back just to eat. Oh, D, he came at the camera. Look at him. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to tease him because. Man, you're some ugly on display. He's really nice. Look at him. He's smacking the camera. Go somewhere else. All right. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put my silver seat right uh, out here. And let's, I'm going to see if you got some balls still. I mean, it's just a camera. The camera's like your back, but my silver sea bright will. Well, I'm, I'm gonna let my silver sea bright show this guy a lesson, even though this guy's like way older than him, so he's probably gonna win. Unless I get a bigger rooster, like my silky rooster. But I think he's older than him too, but my silky rooster is bigger in height. Look at him, back in the camera. Man, you're just a punk. Look at him, he just kicked the camera. Get over there, you stupid rooster. You didn't see that come. I just punched that dude in his chest. <laughs> I'm just playing. Well, <laughs> we got a little bit of fighting action on my farm too. That's like the first time he's ever came at me like that. First time. Like he was never ever aggressive. He was like the sweetest thing ever. Like I could literally pick him up and everything. Get out of here, you silkies. Silkies are hungry, I think. So let me get in here. Let me get in here with the tripod. Set it up. I don't like coming into Silky Coo because I got black and white and like, like uh, one time. All right, you guys. I don't know why, but my uh, the camera said that uh, I needed more space, but I had enough. I don't know why it said that. But now it's back to normal. That's why I just cut off. You can have like a little glitch. Look at my beautiful Silky Roost right there. Well, let me get started feeding them so you guys can see what they do. See? Oh, no, no, no. Unlock the camera now. <laughs> she saw the uh, camera in my hand. She tried to go for it. Let me just get up and show you what's up with these guys. Maybe the wind's kind of dirty. Dusty. There you go. Now it's focused on, on both of them pretty good. So I use a container like this, and I'll fill it up all the way, and there's like, uh, once I feed the Odin Skinny Band, I'm so geez, there's like a little bit always remaining, and that's what I feed my Silver Sea Brights. But their uh, feeder's always uh, full 24-7, so now I'll go with the Silver Sea Brights. These guys will just eat. And I don't think, like, I'm, I don't think I'm gonna get an egg from them today, since they, they both laid yesterday, and they lay, they lay like every every other day, which is pretty good for my Silkies. They did, I mean, once I uh, first was reading on them, they were like, man, Silky suck. They're like the worst layers. They never lay. They're always too busy bringing broody and stuff. And I want that. I want my hens to be broody, but uh, I've, they're, some, they're, they're laying machines too. Oh, yeah. This, these guys have like, uh, these guys get me so pissed off. These guys spill their water every day. Every time I put a water in there, they spill it. So I can't get, I can't leave waters in here. Like I do, but I, I fill it up like so little. Cause they, they, uh, they spill waters like every day I give to them, they spill it. Hungry. Yeah, you guys can see he doesn't have no feathers on his neck. See, it? but he's starting to grow it. Hopefully soon. So these guys aren't really anything to watch right now. He just jumped up there in the roost. So let's go over there to my chicks. I mean. I usually take their uh, container over there, but today, since I'm making the video, I brought a little container for them. Like, I, I usually just take the feeder all the way over there to the shed, and then I feed them like that. And I'm going to come back and water all of these guys. Probably off the video, since this video is already getting pretty long. But yo. And these guys are always really hungry, so... I'll be back. I mean, uh... 
I'm gonna grab the little container real quick and I'm gonna show you. Well, there's actually some food that, uh, see that container's too big. Well, the camera's not even all of them. They're freeze. Whoa, was that a glitch? The camera just froze. Let me just pick it up. So these guys need to have uh, their water clean, their clean. Yeah, I'm pretty sure uh, Samuel, he said that uh, he was that he was sure, definitely sure that uh, my barred rock was a rooster. It's okay, I'm gonna sell him. And he'll be enough to buy a bag of feed. Sorry you guys. That's my morning chores. You guys can just see everything over here. Sorry you guys. I'm gonna leave you off with, with my attitude on the skiing venom. So say bye, Sky. Alright, you guys, thanks for watching. Talk to you later.